the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? It's live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Brazil versus France. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Danilo starts with Alexandro as fullbacks. Casemiro plays alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Neymar. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Ibramecano in central defence. Kingsley Coman plays with Usman Dembele in the wide positions. And up front, Karim Benzema plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. And now they get the ball rolling. Coman. Could play it in. Oh, what's he gone and done? Now well, able to close down the shot. Well, you might say history speaks for Brazil. On seven occasions, they've made it to the final before. They've recorded five victories. They're always going to fancy their chances. How do you view their prospects on this one, Stuart? Well, right at the start of the tournament, I asked the question, are they a great side or just a good side? If they win here today, I think we can call them a great side. They've been excellent all the way through the tournament. Neymar! Saved, but still a chance. Oh, yes! First to score in this final. And it could be highly significant. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So back underway. Will there be a response from France here? Coman. Can he find the right pass? Benzema gives it a go. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Danilo. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like oh, this. Oh, Stuart, they've got to score. No way through. They have to take it away. 
Casimiro. Is this the moment? And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And then it's a wonderful strike from Neymar. He hits it with power, he hits it with pace, and he hits it with accuracy. What a goal that is. It's with Kingsley Coman. An unforced error, you've got to say. Karim Benzema. Oh, big chance. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Goal. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Very quick thinking there. Benzema. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? Well, Brazil, as you can see, haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Yes, a really effective performance all in all. And just putting it over the top. Radio. This is Coman. Griezmann. Far from a good pass. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And there it is, the half time whistle. So back underway into the second half. Brazil with the advantage, but no room for complacency. A chance to whip it in. And he cuts him from the wing, and no way through. Now can they counter clinically? All hands on deck. Mbappe tries his luck. What next in the drama? Well, just look at this strike again. He hits it so well. That's a great bit of skill. No wonder he's pleased with himself. Goal. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. Fabinho. And snuffing out the danger. It's an excellent looking attack from Coutinho, but will they be able to produce from this position? And into the last 30 minutes now. Coutinho. Here's Alexandro. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Couldn't quite hang on. Vinicius Jr. It's got to be. Oh, and it goes to propel them into the lead. Just what they wanted.
Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. Well, the goalkeeper dealt with it admirably. Sustained pressure, and they have the ball now. Coutinho. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Dangerous looking attack. All in all, a broken counter attack. 15 minutes left for play. Coutinho, extremely sloppy in possession. Showing good defensive judgment. And out of play for a throw in to France. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left, and just one goal between the sides. Sumptuous pass from Neymar. And there it is, a chance. I've seen everything now, Derek. Nothing left in this game for me, just the audacity. Facing the keeper, do you slot it past him? Do you take it round him? That would be far too simple. It's ridiculous. No wonder the goalkeeper's furious. It's humiliating. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And the referee brings this final to an end. For the first time in 20 years, Brazil are world champions once more. Well, no surprise there, Derek. Brazil have been brilliant, and they fully deserve this trophy. Brazil, the world champions. And this triumph, you just feel, Stuart, is going to be fondly remembered by all Brazilians. You're absolutely right. They've played some great football. They've been inspiring. There's been some great individual performances. It's been outstanding from them. And the game begins.